Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply, and this video is to bring you a closer look at the ASI number 7402-SD-C. This, this is a recessed satin paper towel, pardon me, uh, satin toilet tissue dispenser, satin finish. This model specifically features the drywall clamp, which is the number 39 galvanized a white coat galvanized drywall clamp. We'll go over that in a moment. So the 7402 recessed roll toilet paper dispenser holder. You'll find this in motel, hotel sort of applications, even residential applications. You'll certainly find these as well. Holds up to a six inch diameter roll. Stainless steel marginally magnetic, which stainless steel at times is. Small amount of magnetism to it. With a satin finish, it's also available in a bright finish as well. Spindle, chrome plated, you know, basically plastic is what this is spring loaded. There is a link below this video to the cut sheet. Let's take a look at that. So the cut sheet shows everything, first of all, important dimensionally about the item. Uh, of note is the outside dimension, six and a quarter wide, six and a quarter tall. The depth from the back of the body to the back of the holder itself is inch and seven eighths. Okay. Something in that range, inch and seven eighths. Importantly, uh, re, uh, most importantly, really regarding dimensions, to know what the rough opening needs to be, five and a half by five and a half by two inch deep. A lot of the times, people are using these as replacements, uh, as often, if not more often, than new construction. So it's important to know what sort of, you know, rough opening this will require. Five and a half by five and a half is certainly in the range of what it's going to require, and that is indeed what it is. Two inch depth, like we said before, that would make sense for that. The specification, uh, the first paragraph on that uh, cut sheet is important because someone might need to indicate to other people, like a, uh, a, a, a you know, a, an end user or an architect, what they'd like to see uh, as an outline in terms of what's being requested. Recessed toilet paper holder, dispense one roll up to six inch, six inch in diameter, 18.8 stainless steel, type 304. You've got the reference to the drywall uh, installation, which are these two dimpled holes in the back. A um, <clears throat> couple of screws here, 832 machine screws. These happen to be uh, a combination thread that would allow you to go right into the back of the unit into a stud. Uh, however, this installation features the number 39 drywall clamp, and the way that that is intended to work is when you create your rough opening, well, the clamp would go in first. And it's supposed to obviously look like this. Well, what you do is into those two holes, you'll run the screws into these two slots. And the more that you tighten them up together, the more that the clamp will tighten against the wall you know, around the drywall. So the installation will end up looking something like that. Okay, that's the installation of that drywall clamp. A uh, very common sort of item to use, especially in retrofit applications. There's a reference to a wet wall installation as well. Lugs that they refer to are not included, but it would be a piece of metal that you would attach to the back here and then gives you an area into which the grout behind the wall would, you know, uh, run through and then anchor itself. Uh, the lugs would anchor itself inside of the, the grout that's pushed into there. Okay. Drywall installation, we've pretty much just covered that. Fasten unit to the wall using the number 10 self-tapping screws through the dimpled holes at the back of the shelf. If the drywall clamp number 39 is specified separately is used, loosely attach mounting clamp to back of the unit 
okay? With the machine screws, insert the unit into the opening and adjust the clamp so that it grips inside opening. Secure the unit by tightening the screws. Very importantly, uh, compliance for ADA uh, guidelines. Center line of roller, 19 inch, minimum above finished floor to 44 inch, maximum above finished floor. With the forward edge of the roll, no farther than 36 inch max from behind the rear wall of the commode. Okay, so it can't be from the rear wall, it can't be any more than 36 inch up. Options at the bottom. You can see how the part number changes based on satin finish or a bright finish. And this is the 7402, so we're going to have an S for satin. The next letter on this model is a D, and when you're looking at the table below, you'll see that that is a drywall installation. Okay, that's what this is. Really nice quality fit and finish on that item. ASI is a full line manufacturer of all things uh, commercial uh, restroom, uh, bathroom related. Not only material that you see in lower end in terms of volume applications like a single roll recessed toilet paper holder, but combination units, waste receptacles, grab bars, mirrors that you'll see in movie theaters, airports, hospitals. If you have any questions on the ASI 7402-SD-C recessed toilet tissue dispenser with a drywall clamp or any other ASI product, please feel free to reach out to us. Thank you.